Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to compute the sine of 3 pi over 4. Let's work through this solution. So we'll start by finding the reference angle for 3 pi over 4. So you draw a picture, here's 0, here's pi, and you can think of pi as a number over 4, so 4 pi over 4, and that can help you because that can help you determine where 3 pi over 4 is. It's going to be here. It's going to be in quadrant 2. So this is the angle 3 pi over 4. And from this picture we can learn a lot. It's going to help us later in the problem as well. So now we can find the reference angle. That is the positive angle made with the terminal side of our angle and the x-axis. So that would be this angle here in white. And this angle you can see is going to be pi over 4 because if you take 4 pi over 4 and you subtract 3 pi over 4, you're going to get pi over 4. And so now we can think about the sine of pi over 4. This is equal to the square root of 2 over 2. That's just from memory. It's really easy because the cosine of pi over 4 is also the same. And so now we just have to ask the question, is it positive or is it negative? Because whenever you're looking for um, the trig function value of an angle, the trig function value of an angle and its reference angle are the same, except for possibly a sign difference. So we just have to figure out if it's positive or negative. So if you think about the unit circle, on the unit circle, every ordered pair has the form cosine theta, comma sine theta. And so sine is the y-coordinate on the unit circle. So we're over here, so the y-coordinate is still positive, so sine is positive, so this is just square root of 2 over 2, and it will remain positive. If it had been down here, then it would be negative, but it wasn't. The angle ended up here, so it's positive. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.